JP, you go five and two thirds, just three hits allowed. Overall, what do you think of your performance? Yeah, I was happy with it. Um, the defense played phenomenal tonight. I had no one strike out, so a lot of great plays behind me. Um, Jose called a great game. It's made some great plays on the field, too, back pick and throwing the guy out. So, yeah, it was a fun night. How were you able to induce so many ground balls? You had nine. Yeah, I think my changeup was just working some tonight. I was pounding the bottom of the zone with it um, and then just using my fastball on the top of the zone to kind of get guys off of it. So, uh, I think just some executed changeups and uh, just mixing up the uh, up and down. You mentioned Jose, him being able to pick off a runner early yeah. and then throw a runner out trying to steal second. What did that do for you? Yeah, that, gi that gives you a lot of momentum on the mound whenever you're two strikes on a guy and there's a good runner on first and then all of a sudden you got one out or two outs, whatever it was. So, like, yeah, that, that helped me a lot, you know, clearing the bases up, kind of feeling like, all right, new inning, just got to get two more outs. So, yeah, that was huge by him. What allows you to be yourself out there and in terms of that channel some aggression? Yeah, uh, I think that I just always kind of go about the mentality of just trying to attack hitters with, with what I got. Like, I'm going to throw fastballs at you and throw my off speeds based off of that and just uh, really just try and fill up the zone and um, and just be as efficient as I can. And, um, and so that's what I try to do tonight. JP, you'd probably be in a lot of other big league rotations starting at your five days. Uh, and here you come up, make a spot, start, go back down. How are you handle that emotionally? Um, emotionally, yeah, uh, that's it's, it's nothing new. I mean, I'm, I'm just going out there and trying to pitch every time I pitch. Uh, the, the business side of the baseball is they'll do that. And I'm just going to show up every time my name's called, and uh, I'm going to fill up the zone and do my best to compete out there. And when you come out this time against Baltimore, do you think, hey, this is 35, 40,000 people versus Scranton, or is that totally out of your mind? No, I, uh, I let myself take that in the first couple of minutes I step on the field to warm up and just accept and you know enjoy it, that part of it. After that, it's the plate, the catcher, and the umpire, and the hitter up there. So, no, not really. You get a nice ovation the man that was that was awesome. That's something that uh, I really appreciate. And, um, you know, watching a lot of baseball growing up was fun to watch. That's, you know, from that side of the TV. So it was fun to be on that side of it tonight. What do you think you've, you've proven in these couple of spot starts or shown um, the world? Uh, I, yeah, I wouldn't use that word. I would just say that I'm, I'm just, you know, I'm going out there trying to compete and um, trying to have fun and really just do my best to help the team win whenever my name's called. And have, they, have they told you, just like last time, you got to go right back to Triple A? Uh, no, I, I don't know anything. Blake talked about how all of you were probably going to have to play a role this year because of the way things are going. Is this kind of how you saw it working out for you, or did you kind of know? Or? Um, I, I, you know, in the season, like y'all know, it's 162 games, like spring training. There's days in between that. It's a long year, so I just try and I take it week by week usually, and I just try and get ready for my next outing whenever that is, and um, I don't really think too much about past that.